Hello my lovelies, so today I want to share with you a creative journaling exercise which I have done before but I'm going to recreate for the purposes of this video. Now this is a journal prompt that I often share with clients and with anyone that I work with actually and it's the question of who am I? And now this is all about understanding who we are truly at the core and it's trying to ditch some of the labels that we have maybe given ourselves or that other people have maybe given us. So you can do this in any way you please within your journal. You can write it, you can, you know, doodle, do whatever you fancy, but I'm just going to share with you today this particular um, method that I came up with and I really enjoyed doing. So I'm going to show you the end product and then we're going to get stuck into it as well. So if you want to ju uh, join along, then please feel free to do so and um, all you need is some watercolors for this particular method and a pen that's it really so this is the end product that I created before so you can see this is like the little body of a person and then I've written all the things that I am at the at the top there so I'm gonna open my journal to another page and I'm going to create basically the same thing again so you can do it along with me so I'm just going to start by drawing the outline of the neck and shoulders of the person of yourself um, and I'm just going to get that started before I start painting the rest of the page. So once you've finished with the watercolours, um, you will need to wait for it to dry before you can write on it. I went out into the garden with a little mooch while mine dried. And we're back now uh, to get started with the writing. We want to try and avoid using labels to describe ourselves at this point. We want to use more kind of personality traits or characteristics of who we are rather than, you know, brother, sister, salesperson, IT consultant, those types of things. We want to avoid them where we can. At this point here I'm just literally adding some extra gold detail because I fancied doing it. This isn't something you have to do, it's just something that I felt called to do uh, when I did this before and I just really liked the way it looked. So it's up to you, you can do whatever you please when it comes to the design of this exercise. You don't even have to do it the way I've done it. Um, if you want to use this design you can but feel free to just allow your creativity to flow. And here we have it, the final piece of my Who Am I creative exercise. I really hope you enjoyed this video, you've enjoyed this short tutorial. Don't forget to like and subscribe and if you create your own version do let me know in the comments below.